Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the John Doherty Field for the matchup between the Nord Mini Mustangs and Quincy. We have a second and third grade matchup here. Hoping it, hoping for it to be a good one here. So we'll see. But yeah, no, these teams are looking like some pretty strong teams. Um, you know, second and third graders are future of the Mustangs. Hopefully, yep. once they come to the high school, so uh, should be a good matchup. I'm liking, the I'm liking the pink socks already. Right oh, pink socks are yeah, nice and style for October. Best best month of football with the pink socks. Yeah, no, you gotta love it. Um, I'm Brian Gaglier, by the way, joined with uh, Anthony, Anthony Kennedy. Anthony Kennedy, yep. Um, we're the hosts of NHS TV pregame live, which you can tune in before each high school football game an hour before. But today we're doing a little commentary with the uh, Nord Youth Football and Cheer today, as we do have cheerleaders in the house as well. Yeah, ready to go. Excited. Yeah. Yeah, it should be a good game. We got a, twin, a coin toss here. Looks like Nord won it. Yeah. What do we think they're doing right off the bat? Ah, probably. I'm going to say boot it. Boot it. I like it. I like it. Get the ball in the second half. Go to work. Get a stop here to start the game off. Showing a little respect here with the handshakes and yeah. Nord's off. Here we go. They chose to actually take the ball is what I'm hearing right now. Yeah. That's what it's looking like. You know, I like that too. Thank you. You know, go down the field right off the right, like first drive of the game, score. All right, we're taking the field here. Should be a big game. Yeah. A little bit of a smaller roster I'm seeing for forward here. You know, looks like just two on the bench so far. I don't know. And just start all of them. Yeah. More playing time. All right, here we go, though. All right, Nord has the ball, thirty-five, their own thirty-five yard line. Looking to go to work. And we're off. Oh, a low snap here, and it's recovered by the quarterback. That is number twenty-six, I believe, Benjamin Weeday. Not an ideal start right there, but a bounce back. Yeah, one play in. Looks like we got some size and strength on the running back back there. Hopefully, he can break loose a couple times. Oh, and we got a QB run. Oh, and he's sacked for about pretty big loss, but we got third down here, and they're gonna have to throw. Ninety nine. On Quincy's going off here. 99. Cassidy Joseph. Joseph Cassidy. Quincy's going to work early. Yeah. Getting a couple nice plays to start off the game. But here we go. So a long third down here. Oh, another... Oh, no. Another botched uh, snap right there. But recovered by the quarterback once again. All right, so fourth down, and they're going for it here. I like it. On the, and it's recovered again on a, Fumbled snap once again. So, looking like Quincy Ball here. Yeah, turnover on downs. Not the ideal start for Norwood, but, you know, it's the first drive. Plenty more drives to go, so hopefully they can bounce back. But for now, Quincy has the ball. Yeah, you know it's early. These kids got to get going, so warm up a little bit. Bet you by the second half, you know, they'll be good to go. 
going the full length of the field, 70, 75 yards, you know, 65 in this, go on the field score. I think we are in a in for a good game. Yeah, we should be. These these teams looking like a pretty good when they're warming up, as we were watching earlier. Um, but yeah, these guys um, should be a really tough matchup tonight. Yeah. For Let's tonight. talk about a beautiful morning, huh? Yeah, no, it is really nice out. A nice little seven o'clock, you know. Sun's coming up. It's Football Sunday. Yep. No sight better to see than this John Doherty Field. You know, I've said it many, many times in our show. Yeah. But how beautiful it is. It's my signature line. But you know, it's a really nice feeling. I was like, just did it over last year. Yeah. New track too. Looks real good. Yeah. All right. So here's Quincy's first snap. Quarterback's rolling out to the left, number fourteen, and nobody's near him. Touchdown, Quincy. That is by number 14, Jonathan Flavin. So just a dominant early performance here by Quincy. You know, oh, you know, you just uh, it was a QB rollout. No one saw him, and he just took it to the house. I mean, good yeah. for him. Smart play there by the by the quarterback. Yeah, no, know. very smart play. Very yeah. fast, number 14. Yeah. Great young ball player. Yep. All right, so it looks like we're going for two here. Don't count out the Mustangs just yet. Oh, no. One no. score in, do not. Never want to count out the Mustangs. Never. No, we, we, we saw back. that on. Well, big shout out to the 25 24 Norwood uh, win the other night. It was came down to the wire, down 11 in the fourth. Yeah, no. Uh, it's a great comeback. Great to be there to watch that. Yeah, it was awesome. Um, so. But just, you know, showing that means that you know, the Mustangs haven't quit yet, so. Yep. Oh, and handoff, and it's fumbled, and it's recovered by Norwood. Number three there. Yeah. Couldn't take it back because of the, just a two-point conversion He's on the ground. But So, Mustangs, the ball. The mini Mustangs, awesome. This is the future of uh, Norwood football here. Yeah, no. <laughs> Starting at the own 35. Big shoes to fill, you know, a good team this year. So, yeah, yeah, starting at the 35, like you said, here. Looking for a couple first downs. Definitely a score. I feel it. You can feel it on this drive. I'm really interested in hearing Joel Moss in the backfield. I feel like he, if he can break loose, you know, no one can take him down. He's looking like a strong kid back there. Here's a snap. Oh, and I get Whoa. to him right away. Pretty high snap right there. Yeah. Um, quarterback slow to get up, and he should be, yeah, he's good. Just, you know, the D-line's looking pretty strong for Quincy, so. Yeah, the O-line's going to have to hold up. Yep. A couple substitutions here for Norwood. Yeah, looking like a little bit of confusion here, but they should figure it out. Definitely figure it out. Oh, they got some strong coaching, too, with uh, Joey Manning's father coaching it. Yeah. Great guy he is. Here's a snap. It's low and it's fumbled again. Recovered. Recovered by, Recovered by uh, number five, Jack Daltz. Stud. Absolute legend. Stud. He is, he is a stud. All right, so we got a we got a third and long once again for the Mustangs. Looking to do something. Looking like we're from about. Uh, 26, 27 here. Here's a snap. Oh, a little it's high. The head. It's a loose ball. And that's recovered by, I believe, number 35, Declan Campbell. Or no, no. Sorry. Number 35, 
Gershom, goodbye. Looking at the wrong, wrong, wrong roster here. Already early. Oh, it looks like we have an injury timeout here. So, open that young man is okay. He looks like he's getting up. Yep, should be fine. All right, so Quincy takes over here. Couple, couple. A little rough start for the Mustangs here, but yeah, it'll be it'll be good. Never count out the Mustangs, like we said. Yep. Shout out to these cheerleaders, by the way. Can we get a quick shot of them, real quick? Out here, seven o five a.m. You know, doing their thing. Huge shout out to them, you know. Looking like we got a big squad over there too. I know, looking like a bunch of up and coming high school cheerleaders, so and some reps in. Yep. Got the pink for yeah, breast I love cancer it. awareness month. Absolutely love it. Probably the best color I would say you can wear. Along with a with a Mustang's jersey, a Mustang's uniform. No, oh, so here's a pass. Nice. And it's incomplete. Oh. Oh, and it's a fumble. It's recovered by Norwood. So a big turnover through know, one great. play. 48. 48 right there. Teddy Pollen. Absolute. He's hyped about it, too. Yeah. He's ready to go. So I feel like this is a momentum change right here for uh, the Mustangs. Yeah, no, definitely. Also, a quick shout out to these guys doing the, the chains here. Freezing cold down there. You know, it's awesome to see. So you look currently. We've got a 6 nothing game. Quincy, as you can see. 11 minutes left in the first. Still an early game, though. So the Mustangs on the... On the right hash at about 44, 43 yard line here. Looking to get something going. A big fumble recovery there by Poland. Um, definitely a momentum change. He just stepped up big for his team, stepped up and made a play. Love to see it. Here's a snap. Oh, and it's over the head again, and it's fumbled. And it is recovered in Norwood. Covered by number 35. Right, so a little bit of a loss for here for Norwood, but let's get let's get some yards here, you know. Second second and Decently long, but oh, a little shoe tie there. That's what was going on. Here we go. Oh, and he sacked again. So this D line for Quincy is no joke. Yeah, no, definitely want to want to be in the wrongdoings of being quarterback here, number fourteen for Quincy. You know, it's awesome. To, it's awesome to come up here as a as a high schooler now. Looking back at you know going to watch your friends in third grade play football, it's pretty awesome to see the new the new generation of Nord football. It's awesome. Yeah, it's always fun coming up watching an American football game too. So. Oh yeah. You know, how much better could the day get? We got some Nord football. Then we got some NFL football. Hopefully, my fantasy team's looking good today. We'll see. Made a couple moves last night. I was getting notifications. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, you got to be ready to go. My team's set. You got to be ready to go. It's looking like Nord is right here. Oh, it's fumbled again, but it is recovered by the quarterback. Oh, 
couple rough drives with Mustangs, but yep. number number three uh, had a good recovery on that one. Yeah, um, that's Elias. The recovery. He's had a couple of recoveries so far. Yeah, his first couple Along of Mustangs, with but Jack Dalton too. Coach Manning getting involved here. Joe Manning's father, who's a senior at the high school. So Quincy takes over here, it's right around the f- uh, the their own forty five. Nord having a little huddle up, as well as Quincy. Yeah, you know, I I bet you the Mustangs are trying to get fired up here. You know, they they gotta they gotta get go- get it going on offense. You know, I feel like their defense has been pretty good. You know, with the fumble recovery there. But Quincy's looking strong, but I think the Mustangs can easily compete. All right, so here's the play. It's a little run up the middle, a little halfback dive, and he's going. Oh, he's running oh good yeah, too, it's running a good. big gain. Big gain there by number five. Great tackle, though, by number three, Elias again. Getting on that. Big gain by I'm number sure six, Jack Mason. Jack Mason on the carry. It's a, it's, a, it's a nice run right there for about, what would you say, 17 ish yards, you know. It's a big run. It is a big run. Ball on about the Norwood, the Norwood 37 here. Uh, Quincy marching into enemy territory. territory. Yeah, no, this Quincy team's looking pretty well, so. Uh, it's currently still 6 nothing with. Time to go. Got a little bit of a diamond formation here. I know. Look number at 14, Jonathan Flavin, under center. And that's handed off to number 35, and he sweeps to the left. And he's taken down for a loss. Right there by... Number 48, Teddy Poland. Yeah, no, great tackle there. Great play uh, there. 41 helping out, too. Um, yeah, 41 being Darrell. Yeah, Darrell no. Harris Jr. This guy's uh like that name. Cleaned up, and now Nord's going to huddle up here. Think of a play. As well as Quincy. Nord figuring out, you know, how to get a stop right here. And uh, Quincy's trying to run all over him, but. Clearly, that's not going to slide with the strong D-line from Norwood. Yeah, no, it's not going to happen with Norwood. And we've reached the end of the first quarter here as well. Start of the second should be happening soon. After this. Let's take a look at the scoreboard here real quick. It is 6-0. 6-0. Quincy. Yeah. Slow first quarter for the Mustangs, but um Yeah, some team discussions here, you know. After that big play for a loss, Nord's looking like they're gonna come back strong here, hopefully. And uh yeah, it should be a great second quarter on their hands. Looks like Nord versus Quincy all day today. Looking like, yep. Every game but the last game today. Starting off sev- second and third, fifth, sixth, seventh grade, all the way up to eighth. You know, it's gonna be a fun afternoon of football, fun and morning and afternoon. No, it's got a great football program too. Oh yeah, TV, so oh yeah. Should be very good. You got some good coaches up there on the eighth grade team, especially too. They do right. Yeah, you know, shout out to all these coaches. Yeah, no. Taking their time, you know, 
basically teaching these second and third graders the rules of football, how to tackle, all that. You know, it's awesome. I know. As you can see, you got Mr. Manning on the field right now, right behind Norwood, guiding his team. Here's a snap. Oh, confusion. The ball's loose. And that is recovered by Norwood. That's a big start to the second quarter. Norwood here. recovers again. Number eight, Norwood. Yeah, number eight, Jack Archibald. Wow. That's a great play there. I don't know that was. You know, some confusion by Quincy there. You know, it leads to a turnover. Leads to a huddle as well here. Cheerleaders love it over there. They're loving that that fumble recovery. Big yeah. play. Big play. You know, two two big plays like stepping up. You know, those two fumble recoveries, big plays there. You know, it takes a lot for you know someone to get on the ground, die for it, die for it on the ground. Yeah, no, definitely. Takes a lot of toughness to. Oh, yeah. Grab the ball. You got a bunch of people trying to grab it, too. But uh, with, with a deck, you know. It's, it's football. Here's Norwood. A high snap. A ten it off. That's a, looks at, looking like a sweep to the right by number 35. And he's going. He's oh. still going. He's still going. Number 35, Gershom. The 20. The 10. He is in. To the house. Norwood touchdown. Wow. About a 60-yarder there. Great play by the young man. It was a great sweep. Right out to the right. Roll. Looking like thought, took it thought to the right house off for the a bat. Tutty. Thought right off the bat. You know, he's lo he's losing a couple yards there. And then and then he turns it around. Takes it to the crib. That's a, that's a strong third grader. That's I awesome. Know. So the Mustangs tied up, you know. I don't know what coaches said in that huddle right after the first quarter, but clearly it 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 built some fire in the in Norwood's stomachs here to tie this game up. Going for two here. Going for two. Love that call. Love it. Yeah, just a great run there by Gershom, number thirty-five. All right, great run. Yeah. Here's a snap. I tanned it off. It's gonna roll out again. Oh, but and he's set, he's tackled. Gershom loses a couple yards there, but fourteen for Quincy. Made that play. Uh, yeah, great play. Jonathan Falvin. Um, yeah, he's been all over the place. You know, playing quarterback on their team. Great player there. Loving the superhero shots we got going on. That's awesome. Sun seems to be rising up here too. Yep, you know it's awesome that that NCM, Jack Tolman, all them producing these games. You know, uh, I remember being younger and the excitement of being like, "Oh, I'm on TV! Oh, I'm on NCM!" Oh, it yeah. was awesome. No, I mean, no, no. there was no feeling good. like it. It was it was awesome. Even a small clip. Yeah, yeah anything. You know, you seeing your face up. on the on the local channel felt like you're on top of the world. And I hope it's the same feeling for these It did. These young School guys. News. When we were doing science projects, I remember I got up there. Good friend of mine and was pretty hyped about it, too. Yeah. No feeling like it, so hoping, hoping these kids are excited, you know. See themselves make plays out here. Yeah, no, definitely. All right, so Quincy with the ball and that little diamond formation again. Maybe a cross handoff again. Yep, and there it is, right up the middle. Oh, and he's still going. Broke it. He breaks off a tackle. The 30. Gershom the only one to get him, and he got him by a shoot string. So a, a touchdown saving play there, but a great run there by, I believe, Declan Campbell, number 35. Great run there. Yeah, no, great tackle, too, by also number 35 for Norwood. Gershom. He's back out there. Gershom's all over the place. He's a stud. Is a stud. Yeah. Um, you know, 
playing both ways. Yeah, no. Touchdowns, making plays both ways. It's awesome. Yeah. But a big run there for Quincy. They're back in their diamond formation, so we'd be expecting that. That cross handoff. We'll see. Here's Quincy from the 25. The cross handoff. Once again to, I believe, 35. And he's taken down. A great tackle there. Great play. Gershom with the, with the play again. Yeah, no, looking like an absolute dog out there. Yeah. He's looking like a dog. Absolute dog. Second down. Yeah, second down here from about the Nord 28. No, I'm sorry, excuse me. The Nord 23, 24. After. Yeah. <laughs> A second and eight, two, maybe. Right around. Yeah. Probably forward progress will give him two yards. But Gershom pushing him back to the line of scrimmage. Oh, a different formation here. Wide receivers lined up a little far back. But oh, and it's a keeper. Number 14. There he goes, a sweep to the left again. And he's going. And he's brought down by Gershom. But he should have a first down, yep. Yeah, and he does have it. It's a great run by uh, Quincy there. Yeah, Jonathan Flavin. You know, he's looking like he's all over the place as well. Yeah, no, he's having a great game himself. Through this first half. 6-6 six, six in the second quarter. Yep. Looking like it's going to come down to the wire, be a dog fight. Yeah. Wants it more. All depends on that. Yep. The ball from with the left hash. Right around there. Yeah, the Nord 11. So, they're in the red zone here. Yep. Long huddle here. Drawing up, probably drawing up a nice play here. All right, Flavin under center. We got a bunch on the left side. And handoff right up the middle, it's fumbled, it's fumbled. Oh, and it's recovered by the old lineman. That's number 47, or 77, Kellen Lyons. You know, very alert to to recognize that fumble and dive on it right away. I think we have a correction there on who recovered it. I think it was actually 97. 97, Keegan Sampson. But, you know, Quincy looking like need a little reassurance here on their second down here, right around the 12-yard uh, line. About a, say, second and nine maybe. So, yeah, I would say he recovered it right at the right at the spot. So, yeah, no. Flavin under center with that same bunch on the left. 35 in the backfield. Oh, and a throw. Oh, and it's down. It's loose. And it's recovered by Norwood. That's number 48, Teddy Poland. It's a great play right there. Looks like he's been making plays all, all morning, too. Yeah, I know. First down, Nord. Nord takes over here. You know, it was a great, great way to stop Quincy. Got on top of it. You know, made it Mustangs. drive going back. Mustangs forcing three fumbles early on this game in the first half. You know, the defense is looking like an absolute dog out there. So, how to make plays if you're a dog? And that's what we're seeing early on from the Mustangs. Yeah, no, six six game, second quarter, all tied up. Sun's coming up. Yeah, this is this is an entertaining one, you know. We're seeing more 
more fans walk in. Yeah, no, oh. slow start, but as more fans sh- trickle in here, it's look like uh, better plays here from the... Uh, Good atmosphere here, too. Yeah. All right, Nord in their own half a throw. And it's incomplete. Intended for number three, Elias. So second down for the Mustangs. You know, the Mustangs in their in their own within their own twenty. Chewy, does it getting getting going right now? Getting going, you know, just waking up. Once having the morning dunking. All right, here's a toss. Here. Oh, it's Ooh. incomplete. Toss to Gershom. Quincy's and not he's taken let him down for a loss. Great play by the Quincy D line. You know, sending sending the sending the boys. Yeah, no. Uh, so no, we're deep in their own, in their within their own twenty. Looking like we're inside the five here, maybe the three yard line. Yeah, no. Uh, great play. Right, Quincy wasn't going to let uh, number 35 roll out and take it to the house again. Gershom. 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 Great player. Was indeed a great play. Uh, What's going on here? We got a flag or something? Or? I don't. Oh, that might, that might lead us to the end of the half. I'm thinking. You know, we don't have a clock. I think they go by plays, so it's a little hard to tell one. Yeah, it is. Uh, I think Nord's getting some substitutions out there. Number 36 is strutting on the field. I'm liking the sweatshirt under the uh, the jersey. Stay, gotta stay warm somehow, you know? Oh, I used to do it during hockey all the time. Yeah. Uh, you know, the early morning games and the old Ponca Pog drink. It'd be freezing cold. I'd chuck a hoodie on right over it. Yeah. Right, uh, I'm like a... Having like a six AM fall ball game, fall ball fall baseball game in uh in some place north, but you know, if you love it, which I'm sure these guys love it, they're right here at seven AM warming up or six AM warming up. You know, you gotta love it. So that looks like sweet. the passion is definitely there for Norwood. Yeah, no, definitely uh Got to make a, uh, there really is nothing like a sunset at this field. No, there really isn't. Uh, sunrise, though. So, uh, yeah, sunrise, sunrise. <laughs> so, my yeah, ma- mixing, up, mixing up my sunset and sunrise, just talking about sunrise. It's a little early in the morning, eh, Akon? Yeah. All right, number 14, rolling out. Oh, and he gets loose. The only person to catch him is not in time, and that's another touchdown. But number 14, Jonathan Flavin, he has been ru- doing that little keeper to the left all game. Yeah, I know. Looking like, uh, you know, teammates got the celly down, too, up and bumping. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, Quinn's going to take a uh, 12-6 lead here. 12-6. With Going for two, hoping to make it. For them, hoping to make it 14-6. Yeah, no. Um, in the second quarter. No, it was a great play. Unfortunate break. Uh, took it to the house. And uh, Nord just got to, you know, get over it, reset, and get ready to, for their next drive, too. Yeah, can't let it linger, you know? No, you can't. You know, the, the body language from these kids is really what's sticking out, you know? Yeah, no, definitely. Of everyone else. The body language is a big part of every sport, and... These kids have it down, whether they're down or up, you know. I don't see any heads dropping down. And that's what you love to see. Yeah, no, definitely. Quincy lining up for two here. Flavin under center. Now high formation. Oh, I think we had a false, false start, start there by the left tackle. Flags down. Look at Norwood playing to the whistle. Diving in to make a play right there. Number 48, Teddy Pullen. Yeah, no, unfortunate fault. 
False start for Quincy here. It's number it's 81. It's going to set him back to about 83. Lynn. Caden Lynn. Norwood back in, er, Quincy back in that. <laughs> oh, a nice play there. A good handoff. And he is, is he in? He's short. Down at the one yard line. That was a great, great <laughs> handoff there. Yeah, no, Norwood typed right now. They're buzzing to the bench. They're feeling great. Yeah, you know. Big got, loss. You got Brian cracking jokes on the end of this, so Crack excuse the laughing. <laughs> but I was just not cracking jokes, but we'll, we'll go with cracking that. Cracking jokes. You know, you know, you gotta you gotta have a positive attitude when you when you're you know having fun here. Uh, Nords looking like the end of the half here, so. Uh, See you right after, after the break. Yep. <laughs> All right, we're back for a second half football between Nord Mini Mustangs here and Quincy. No need to call them the Nord Mini Mustangs. They're just Nord Mustangs, you know? Absolute dogs out there. Oh, absolutely. Quincy ball here. Here's a run, a little sweep to the left. Oh, he cuts back. Number six. Oh, great cut back there, too. Great run there by number six, Jack Mason. My co-host here, Brian, <laughs> is having a donut off. Off mic, so let's give us a review here. Uh, what are you thinking of Honeydew Donuts? Look, when you get a free donut, there's no feeling like When someone comes up and offers you a free donut, you're going to take the free donut. Yeah, but. It's a great donut, though. It's like an 8.9. If we get an instant replay on what happened, I don't think anyone came up to you and said, Do you want a donut? <laughs> so. <laughs> I'm just saying, an instant replay, I think I think you're they're throwing a flag right there. Throwing a flag for what? Calling it back. Yeah. You know. Say that. Say that. Huge shout out here to <laughs> Kiki Baxter. What is she, Brian? A dog. A dog. <laughs> Kiki Baxter, I know you're watching. So. Yeah, no. They, um, both her, Brian Boudreau, Tim Rose. Ron Marchesee with your sports update. You tune into Nord News usually at the end of the week, around uh, Thursday and Friday. Um, catch up with um, 
Living Local with Brian Boudreau. Kiki Thaxter's uh, monthly updates and uh, Ron Marshall C Sports update. So, great crew that Huge we're lucky to have. Them. Yeah. Lucky to have this opportunity to commentate this game, too. And lucky to have their hope when they're helping us with our pregame our show. show. You know, we, got a, we had a great crew down there last, last Thursday night. It was a fun night. You can tune into that on demand and on the North Community Media YouTube. That's right. As we have a run to the right side here by number 14, Flavin. He's still going, and he is. He's this is a great player. I think we're seeing here. Yeah, no, definitely one of the standouts here, number 14. Yeah. Very impressed with the talent of some of these kids. Yeah, no. As we have another Quincy first down here. Ball on the Nord thirty six. Oh, cheerleaders look like they're getting a little running. Gotta get the, gotta get the legs going. Legs going. All right, that, that diamond formation. I'm thinking a uh, little cross handoff to thirty-five here. I don't know about you, but I can I can smell it. And there it is. And he cuts right up the middle. Finds a hole and he cuts to the outside. There he goes. The 20. And he gets caught down right before the 10. But that cross handoff is really working and causing some, some confusion. Yeah, right it was a great run. 35's all hyped up. He's ready to go. Declan Campbell, by the way. Gershom with the tackle. Gershom with the tackle. He's a dog. Yeah, you love to see it. He's out there making plays. Probably above five plus tackles, I'd say, so far. Now, I could use him for my fantasy team because my defense is struggling. That's why you got to switch out your defense every week. You know, I go I go off of, you know, whoever's playing, like, one of the bottom teams. You know, it was the Texans, but C.J. Stroud, good player, so. Can't really do that anymore. <laughs> I can't wait to beat you next week. All right, and that diamond formation on the left hash here, just inside the Nord 15. All some confusion by the running backs here. All right, Flavin under center. The snap. It's fumbled. Oh, recovered by Norwood. Uh. Recovered by Norwood. Oh, yes. Nord's feeling it right now. They're, they're all bumping. Not one. Not two, not three, four fumble recoveries. Four fumble recoveries. Four fumble recoveries. Teddy Pullen with the second of the day. Yeah, no, shout out Dave Daltz for reminding me who that was. Yep. <laughs> Dave Daltz in the booth with us, too. PA announcing. Question is, though, is Dave Daltz a dog? He's a dog. Dave Daltz, you a dog? He's a dog. He is he a, dog. He's a dog. Can confirm he is he's, a dog. He's barking in the press box right now. He's <laughs> living life. <laughs> Shout out to Looses. Yeah, shout out to Looses for putting on the show every week. <laughs> you know, putting it all on, on all their TVs. <laughs> you know, a little spillage of the chocolate donut here on the on a roster. Yeah, you <laughs> you did that, <laughs> Mister Tolman. I did not do that. I want to make that clear. The uh, game's more important than my donut. So. Oh yeah. It is. <laughs> Well, big hit there. Think like a second and a little bit behind the line of scrimmage, Nort. Uh, 12 6 game, by the way, in the third quarter. 
So. But, you know, the Nord Mustang should be able to uh, cook something up here and get down the field. Yeah, looking like 90-plus yard drive here. I, I, I see it. I see it happening. You see it. You feel it. You want it. And then you know you do? You go do it. Oh, okay. Yep. You know what? I'm going to take that. And, and these Mustangs are going to go with it. And uh, load right up, up the middle. Here, so looking like a third and decently long here. Yeah, no. Mustangs. Definitely, uh, definitely, uh, nice running play there. Ryan, how about you give us a little quote of the day today? Quote of the day? day? Yeah. Uh, let's see what's cooking up the. A little quote of the day, actually, you know, for some inspiration. Mm -hmm. You know, people at home watching. You know, as John Cena once said, never give up, so. I never give up on yeah. these Mustangs here. And, and then no one could see him. Yeah, no, so. it's going to be the quote of the day. Huh? Never Here's give up. Snap. John Cena. Oh, and it's a QB sweep to the left. And there he goes. And he's got the first down, I believe. See, my quotes work, you know. You just never give up. And that guy was an absolute dog. And that and that is first down. The electricity. Elias. Building up. Elias. What a beast. He is a beast. He's a dog. You know, the electricity is really increasing here. Yeah, no, I'm getting going now. You know, I'm up. I'm going. It's uh, it's about 7.47 in the morning, but, you know, we're up. We're going. We're with Dave Daltz. He's a dog. We're buzzing. No one's buzzing. That was good for a what? Uh, first down. No word first down. Right, here we go again. Oh. Around the middle. The ball's loose, it looks like. Oh, and it's recovered by Quincy. Oh, that's a killer. <sighs> you know, coming off that big play, it hurts. They have a little fumble there. You yeah, know. Got to do a little regroup in here. They got to they gotta force a turnover quick here. Hopefully take the lead, you know. Go down the field, score a touchdown, and then, you know, punch it in for two and be good to go. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no way it's going to come up. Hopefully come up with a big play. Uh, Looks like some subs here for Norwood. Like some tossing some people in. Got to get the defense in, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Defense wins championships, you know? It does. It does. Yeah, this Mustang's defense has held their own. All right, so Quincy Ball inside the Nord 25. Perfect field position. If I'm Norwood here, the defense, I'm looking out for that. Either that cross handoff or the uh, or the quarterback sweep to the left. Yeah, no, definitely that. Probably, uh, probably has been their top two plays. Not too much passing, you know. These guys are still young, still developing the passing game. Uh, for now, it's just you know get the fundamentals down and uh, get going out there. So, yep, thirty uh, fives, but in the backfield with Flavin under center. Um, thirty fives having himself a day, and there he goes again. Breaks a tackle, but gets gets kind of pummeled there by Nord. Uh, Three person tackle. Number two, hey, number Jack Daltz with the tackle there. He's a dog. He's he's built in dog. Like number he's been a dog since day one. Campbell on the carry. A couple yards. A couple yards here. Oh, okay. Don't a little backhand coming off. Yeah, no, don't. Don't be dissing Jack Dolls. He's a dog. Seem like a 12-6 uh, ball game here. Uh, second down on the Norwood 23-ish. Uh, looking like maybe a second and seven. And uh, Quincy's lining up here. Yep. Takes a step. Yeah. Number six oh. running across. 
I don't know. I think oh, there's a flag. A little flag on the play. I don't know what we get in here. A little, maybe a little. Looks oh, like an offside. A flag on North. Offside. Neutral zone for action, maybe? I don't know. All right. Ball inside the 15 now. Lindsay. Yep. Dalt's giving us the update here. It was offsides on Norwood. Um, we're going to have to make that readjustment. And uh, get ready to go. All right, number six in motion here. Oh, fumble. Fumble. Oh, it's but loose. he gets on it, and Nord gets right on top of him to give him some yards back. Looking like it's uh, going back to around the 20-yard line just in front. At probably like 19 a 19-yard line. Third and six on the 20. Still in the red zone. Cheerleaders are getting a little cheer off it, looks like. Uh, Shout out to them once again. Yeah, I know they're great. Um, Alright, so let's see if this uh Quincy team has drawn up a play. You know, they tend to have longer huddles here. You know. You know, longer huddles, but they gotta get the strat down, so Yeah. Absolutely. So they're here in that diamond formation again. I'm thinking it's going to thirty five up the middle. You know. Up the middle, yeah, probably up the middle. Uh, probably gonna be, maybe bounce it to the outside, but oh, it's a fumble! Oh no, he's got it. Wagon, oh. you can't stop him. A little juke! Oh, and there he goes to the outside, number fourteen, and he's in. Lavin is in for his third touchdown of the game on that same play. Yeah, I know it was a great tutty right there, and he's his. They're all feeling it, and looks like Quincy's starting to pull away. Yeah, I kind of taking a commanding lead here. Uh, Eighteen to six in the third. Oh, we got an injury here. Oh, seems as we do. Um, hoping that he gets up. Looks like it's towards. We'll the be right leg. back after this. Yeah. And he's up and going. Yeah, we're back. Number five, Jack Dalton's a little shaken up after the play, but he's up. He's going. He's up. He's ready to go. He's going to go back to the bench, get re-healed, and uh, get right back out there. A couple plays, be right back out there. Yeah. He's a good player there. But uh, Quincy's going to go for two here after their uh, little touchdown. Tutty. Need a Lamar Jackson performance just like uh, Flavin here today. You have yeah. him as your QB? Yeah. One of my leagues starting. It's a questionable pick with Lamar Jackson, I'm being honest. He's not that good. Two, it's him or Tua. Tua is way better. Put my faith in him. Tua is way better. You know, that's a personal opinion. It's not personal. Nice. It's not it is, but I'll let it slide. It's fine. Oh, okay. Thanks for letting it slide. You can tune in for more of me and uh, Anthony's uh, banter and crazy stuff with interviews with uh, coaches, players on uh, NHS TV pregame live. Uh, Great show. Fun show. Hour before each football game. Um, but enough saying, talking about that, uh, Quincy took the snap. Oh, on to hand off right up the middle, and he's in. Number three right there. Number three. Quincy. CJ Chamberlain. He, you know, it was a great play. You know, broke that tackle and got right in, and he's loving it. about it. He's loving it, so. Yeah, no. They're just going to take it back to the coach, figure out what they need to do, because now they're going to switch over to defense as Nord has the ball. Yep. Or a ball here after that two point conversion. I know Nord's uh running over to the uh thirty five. Gonna start right around there. And uh yeah. 
Quincy's gonna come up. They're gonna get it lined up, and they're gonna uh, start Norwood's drive here, right around or on the thirty-five. On the thirty-five. Um. Um, fourth end quarter th- here. Yeah, and the third going into the last quarter here of the uh, seven o'clock game, twenty to six, Quincy, for the second and third graders. I'm looking for a comeback here from the Mustangs. Oh, Acon's looking for a comeback here. Uh, I think they're gonna come back too. If I'm really being honest, uh, looking like a uh, strong. Strong uh, drive here in the last quarter with uh, however so minutes left. Uh, we do not know due to the uh, clock not working on us. But um, Second and six. Nope. First down, Norwood. Sorry. I don't know where you got second and six. <laughs> Considering they have room to play. Yep. But looks like we got some confusion on the Norwood side. Confusion by me too, I guess. I guess I just don't know my. It downs. happens. It happens. Okay. All right. Yeah. So first and ten, Norwood. <laughs> Luckily, no play clock because this is this is rough. Elias is running back out there. He's gonna line up. All right, here we go. Oh, uh, fumble again. Recovered, though. By number 48, Teddy Poland. He's recovering fumbles all day, offense and defense. Yeah, you know, they're trying to get uh, the work the work down. And, uh, you know, a couple fumbles happens, happens during the games. And... Uh, and I uh, hopefully uh, I know we can work on it in practice and uh, have it set to go for the rest of the season. But, you know, hopefully uh, once I get up to the high school, Coach Manny Lopes will have them ready to go, make a big TVR run maybe in the future. Yeah, I'm already seeing a TVL chip, which the current Nord Mustangs will win this year. Don't quote them on that. Putting it out there. Yeah. So second down here from the Mustangs. Oh, and it's fumbled. Uh, fumble. Looks like Noah's gonna get on top of it though. Who has like it? for third and very long. Yeah, twenty three is all hyped up <laughs> for Quincy. Or is he trying to get his gloves 23 off? Twenty three isn't like it. He uh, wanted no, that I think ball. He's trying to get his gloves off. I don't he know. He wanted that ball. I think he's trying to get his gloves off. I don't know. Uh, yeah, no. Uh, but sun's fully uh rise risen over the field. Uh, you know. Uh, it's great, beautiful Sunday. Uh, all right, so. Third and very long here for the Mustangs. Another fumble. First down, Quincy. Yeah, turnover on down. Thanks, uh, Dave Dolph. Dalton. He's a dog. For that update. Um, but, you know... Uh, fourth quarter, couple minutes remaining. Um, Nord's got to make a big defensive play here. Uh, but they should be able to, uh, get set for this drive, take it downfield, and, uh, house of Tuddy, maybe? Yeah, you know, it's Quincy Ball, right? Yep. Oh, no. Uh, that's my bad. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah. 
Uh, um, Everyone at home, tell Brian to wake up, please. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, it's Quincy's, so hopefully Nord can get a stop here. Ball in the Nord 30 here. You know, hopefully Nord's not losing hope here. Still got some time left. Here's a snap. Oh, and a big tackle there. What a Number play. five for Norwood. Dal Jackson Dalton. Jack Dalton, he's a dog. You know, after shaking up a little bit, he's back in the game. Already making plays big big for a loss, you know. Uh, um, Norwood uh, had a big uh, first down play there. Tackle for a... You know, barely any gain. I'm pretty sure they got maybe one yeah, yard. No. Oh, no, yeah, it's it a tackle for, for a loss. loss. So it was five yards a loss. loss. Five please, yards please a loss. Please wake up. Um, Early on in the morning, though. You're, you're, good. you're good. Oh, oh, thank you, Rico. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, I'm calling this play going to 35 up the middle. He's just amazing. I catch back left. Gain about five. No, I think that Nord's going to make them you lose yardage here. <laughs> there it is. Oh, and he's still going. Gain of about seven there. 35 is stunned. You Jack know. Daltz, though. Two tackles in a row. Dec Declan Campbell. Oh, looking like we have we a player injured. down here, too. Oh, no. It's not looking too good. Hopefully this young man can, you know, get up and be all right. Um, it's unfortunate when a player goes down, you don't want to see anybody get hurt. Yeah, you don't want to see anybody. And then he's up. Ah, oh, he's up, though. Limping off, but. Oh, he's, and there he goes. Ah, he's, he's running. running off. He, nothing phases him. Nope. He's a dog. 35, Declan Campbell. Great player, by the way. Great young ball player. I give a shout out to the NCM guys. Thank you, uh. Mr. Tolman for giving us the opportunity to commentate this game. Uh, great guys over at NCM. Yep. You know, Tim Rose, all them. Kiki Thatcher. Dog. Dog. Flying Mondo P. Brian Boudreau. Megan Corbett, of course. She's very nice. Sarah Sullivan. Yep. All very kind over at NCM. Yeah. You know. It's awesome. Great crew over there. Great production by them, everyone. Got some of the best, the best local content. Yeah, no, definitely. All right, so Flavin under center, number six. Oh, okay. he's got a QB sneak oh, too. Oh, he's sitting. He's keeping, and there he goes again. Oh, and a little celebration there before getting in the end zone. That's four touchdowns for number 14, Jonathan Flavin, the QB. He is a great player. Great player. Yeah. Um, it was a great run. Uh, just kind of snuck through everybody, and uh, Quincy taking a commanding 26 to 6 lead over the Mustangs. Lead here. in the fourth. Like a tough game for the second and third graders, but you know they play played well overall. Yeah, they kept it close for I would say eighty percent of this game. Yeah. No, they uh did very well. Um, just you know, very strong Quincy team they faced and uh kind of snuck away with it in the fourth. But guess what? This game is not over. Our no, game's not over. Game is not over. Never say never. Looking like we got coming up a fifth grade game here. Shortly after. <laughs> With Prime once again cracking jokes behind, behind, <laughs> behind the camera. Jolly guy. Yeah, you know, you gotta have some fun out here. 
get the job done, have some fun, you know? Yeah, I'll definitely. Uh, but looks like uh, just a little, little bit in the fourth remaining. Uh, don't know the exact time due to the uh, time clock not working, but no, they don't. I'm pretty sure they don't use it in second grade football. You go off of plays, you know, drives. So the two point conversion here, it's a little backed up. Diamond formation here. Oh, and we get a false start. Ah, false start. You know, they can. those are the tough ones that they can kill. Um, but, you know. Gives uh, Nord a little more opportunity to uh, go make a play. Yeah. Brian, having a little bit too much fun, you know. Why are we calling me out? <laughs> it's so long. Two point conversion here. Yeah, it's gonna be a pretty long uh, conversion. Um, but hopefully, Nord's got something up their sleeve that can just absolutely tackle and uh, move on. Oh, and it's a sweep to the left end. Oh. Braces. He breaks a tackle. But Nord takes him down. Nord takes him down. Nord does take him down. All right. Let's go again. Uh, little 26-20 game, huh? Or 26-6 game. Yeah, down by 20. It's about three possessions. Uh, looking like a tough fourth quarter for the Mustangs. But um, hopefully, th hopefully they can, uh, you know, take off with the ball. Maybe get a tutty in there before uh, this game passes. Time expires, yeah. Very, very tough to get the uh, ball down the field, you know. Just it's not, it's not an easy game, so. First down, Mustangs. Got some switches for the Mustangs. A couple players coming off. Gotta get the offense going here with uh, in the fourth quarter. Down, down by a little bit, so. <laughs> Looks like maybe the scoreboard isn't updated or... Yeah, no, the scoreboard is not updated, but uh, it's okay, though. Shout out to Dave Paul for giving us the information on uh, how come he's a dog. Uh, so. Right, second down Norwood here. Yeah, no last play kind of set him back a little bit. Um, but hopefully they could strike something and get it get it over the yard scrimmage and get some uh, gains. A oh, high snap. Ah, oh, fumbled. Fumbled. Just fighting for it, fighting for it, and it's uh, looking like it's going to be Nord Ball. Nord Ball. Gershon. Gershon. He's a dog. Uh, but it's looking like it's going to be a third and long here for uh, Nord. You know, but I'm fine. Fun doing this game right now. You know. Love Nord Sports. Call myself a Nord Nord Sports super fan. 
so. Can't complain. Beautiful booth. Three people in here. Uh, oh, my bad snap again. It's going to be a tough fourth down for Fourth Norwood. down, Norwood. Norwood on the fourth. Fourth down and long. Looking like they're going to set up for uh, just tough, tough play. Low snap. Yep. Ball rolled. He had to get down on it before Quincy got to them. But and it's looking it. like the end of the game here. So 26 to 20. 26 to 6. <laughs> 26 to 6. Sorry. Quincy. Quincy with the win, you know. Lord fought hard. Yeah, no, they definitely did. Uh, shout out to all the coaches on both teams, the Norwood cheerleaders. Yeah. Uh, the football players, they worked. Norwood did really well today. Uh, shout out to Dave Daltz for PA announcing it. Um, but final score, 26-6. to six. Norwood from NCM. Tune in for the fifth grade game right after this. Yep. I'm Brian Gagliard with... And I'm Anthony Kennedy. And uh, catch you on the next one. Yep.